hello water signs today is your day to get your past present and future reading we've got lapis lazuli i just picked this up and now it's here and i think that's fitting also today is monday so today is the well it's related to the moon so like blue white silver those types of colors i am wearing gold here but it's okay it's okay Anyway, let's get into your past um, energy. We have Page of Wands, Seven of Wands, and Nine of Wands. So already there's a lot of action-oriented situations going on. And how this looks is that you've made a decision to go after something and it looks like you are having to defend your decision. And maybe this made you uncertain, so you're kind of thinking on it, and you're just kind of like, okay, is this just a phase? Is everybody right? You know what I mean? So then on to the present information that we are given with the Page of Pentacles, Two of Wands, and King of Swords, okay? So Page of Pentacles is like a working type of energy. Um, it can symbolize like good, you know what I mean, stuff going on. And then with the Two of Wands, of course initiation of a plan and the king of swords can be like kind of unpredictable um so maybe everybody thought you were just focused on this one project something that they would approve of notice the air quotes <clears throat> and um you you really had your own thing going on i mean with water signs you never really know what's gonna <laughs> what's gonna happen um it's almost like a whatever they were saying whatever their judgments were went in one ear and out the other because i mean these things could be symbolic of horns you know what i mean but i feel like to me i'm taking it as ears because this is a very mechanical critter and to me those look like ears i mean they look like horns but i'm taking it ear like in one ear out the other you know what i mean like you're not really listening but to them you got everybody thinking or everybody's thinking that you're gonna make the decision that they want you to make you know what I mean in, in other words like you've already made up your mind but you do have other things to focus on so I think everybody right now is kind of fooled into thinking like oh yeah they're listening to us even if what's best for you is not the same as what's best for them so with the king of swords here we do have some very I think you can see clearly that what they're trying to do is manipulate you into making a different decision but you like i said the king of swords energy tends to be sort of unpredictable like and the reason is because they don't outwardly show their emotions they don't always speak you know what i mean if they don't have the right words they just won't say anything at all they'll just keep working on their projects and so you don't really know what's on their mind you know what i mean then in the future we do have this petty card right here um <laughs> um we have king of cups and queen of wands so what's interesting is that the king of cups can be very passive passive aggressive and the queen of wands can also um have a tendency for cattiness um i feel like the queen of wands won't mess you know won't get messy um if you just leave her alone but i feel like people are like egging it on or just like Maybe somebody is just trying to stir up some, you know, stir the pot and like get you into your, you know, aggression so that way they can turn it around on you and be like, aha, see, I told you, um, and point the finger. But when you point your finger, you've got three fingers pointing back at you, you know what I'm saying? Those who live in glass houses should not throw stones type of energy. So I really do feel like there is a union coming between the Queen of Cups, sorry, the King of Cups and the Queen of Wands because they are, they're attracted to each other. And I'm wondering if this is your decision. Like it doesn't even have to start off like, like, like a relationship, like, you know, man and woman. But it definitely could be some type of union. You know, maybe somebody doesn't even want you to be friends with this person. You know what I mean? But the Queen of Wands, what are you going to tell her? And the King of Cups, you know, he's a sensitive, caring person. So, you know, he wants to care for the people, you know, situations that he cares for. So it's going to be like telling him like, no, you can't do that. Plus there's the King of Swords energy here. Like you can't tell the King what to do. <laughs> But we've got all these petty little squabblers who don't mean anything trying to uh, trying to manipulate the situation to fit their narrative. And they're ending up like, 
like here and the thing is you don't even know who's fighting each other it's like who are you really mad at so ask your people that like what are you really upset about like if they can't give you an answer then it's not valid you know I, I know we love our family, but understand, like, family don't always know what's best for us. You know, who the right type for your cousin might not be the right type for you. Or the right type for, you know what I mean, maybe you like somebody who has a sense of humor and someone else likes somebody who's more quiet. Like, I mean, not that you can't be quiet and have a sense of humor, but hopefully you understand what I mean. Like, everybody's going to have their own fit. And it's interesting that I just said that because this actually, to me, this here in the corner reminds me of puzzle pieces. You know what I mean? I guess it's just a design, but that's what I thought of it when I when I looked at it. But I'm I am seeing like a fire energy. Like initially I thought that this was a plant, right? But it's actually a torch. But it looks like this. So I do feel like water signs, you may be dealing with the fire sign. Um because we do have the Queen of Wands ending it here. Lots of wand energy. And wands are fire because they're action, you know what I mean? Physical. Um so yeah, I just feel like someone is trying to change your mind, Scorpio, and I mean, I could do, uh, let's see, mm, mm, what are you doing, okay, I just need the clarification, can you clarify, actually, God, I don't even know what to clarify first, um, clarify the seven of wands, what are we defending, let me just make sure that I know, what are, what are we defending here, water sign? Oh, look at that. Right there. Army. Looking. Leading. Like, you don't know where I'm looking. Protractor. Measuring. So, standing on top of the world. Decisions determine destiny. Okay, defending your decisions. Seven of Wands, like I said. Okay. Then we got this. And the picture is symbolizing, okay, well, let's just take a look here. Is that a puppy? Oh, she got a little puppy sitting there. She's sitting waiting by the phone. There's roses and a letter from a bird. So messages, receiving messages, kind of like, this is the waiting game right now. Like somebody is sort of, oh, Lord, look at, the, look, look at this right there. I know that it's February, but all this, like, this does look like it's starting to turn into like a definite like relationship reading so I am feeling like now this does have to do with somebody like a romantic partner you know what I mean obviously this time of year Valentine's Day people are thinking about love and you know like their significant others but uh it definitely does look like somebody is awaiting a letter like if you even look I mean the birds are relatively ambiguous in the background but then we've got one sitting here so I don't know maybe you have a choice between two loves or something like that or maybe see this looks like a matriarch figure I feel like there's this may be a matriarch who's trying to stop something from coming um interesting how she does have a phone there and still there's a bird with a letter interesting Okay, well, what do we have here? Okay, the strength card. All right, carrying on your back. But more roses, okay. So, I mean, I'm getting like the forbidden fruit here type energy. You know what I mean? Um, I feel like somebody's trying to rule over your destiny. And that's just not going to happen, water sign. So, mm -hmm. get it together. Decide what's best for you because... I mean, the Queen of Wands is not going to be around forever. Don't let other people play games. Like, honestly, just that's what I got for you right now, water signs. Take care.